Go to Tomberg and tell the people there what's happened. I'll have a look around for other survivors. Okay, nice one, Tinker. Actually, yeah, Tinker found you and he saved you. I'm wondering if I should just put the dog in charge and follow along. Probably a good idea. Are you still searching? We're searching in that direction. Look, I said I might put you in charge, but what have you found? Nettles. A bridge. Nope, I'm back in charge. Although you've cared for your family since you were a young girl, it can be very difficult to assert yourself in a man's world. It's like all men expect no more of you than to cook, clean and bear children. Since a man's word has greater weight than yours in this society, it's harder for you to convince them of anything. You have a minus two penalty in dialogues with the opposite sex. Right. That explains why nobody wants to listen to me. It doesn't explain why the dog doesn't necessarily always want to listen. Actually, maybe it does. All right. So, according to the map, we probably... Well, right, we can swing... No, you know what? Let's go this way. Go around and then we can check through the entire area. Yeah, that's possibly the best thing to do. We could also check towards the woodcutters, but that's a little close to the city. Let's keep on the outskirts for now. Oops. I am seeing smoke. No one's a match for me and I'm you, liking, eh? I'm liking the idea that you just get stuck in there if something is an enemy. There's no way I'm going to end up hiding from them. And having you just... Yeah. All right, all right. So... Is there anything here that could be useful? <sighs> Arrows? Probably not. Right, let's keep on going. There could be more deserters. Okay, I think this is it. Let's... wash really I mean I'm not saying I need to make myself presentable for any good reason but it would just be nice to wipe some of well everything off me all right dog skin hot mm, you know what spade might be useful don't know about the other stuff. Okay. All right. I'm not seeing anyone. Come here. Right. You know the deal. Let's see what you can sniff out here. We're see looking for more people, preferably our people. Okay. 
I am in the right place, aren't I? This, this, this is, this is, I think we're, this is here. So we're going to be heading. Okay, don't, don't, don't be going down there. I think we need to be checking over there. Oh, it is. It's it's machinery. Okay. Okay. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Find something. Find something. I'm not seeing. I think. We need to be looking over here, maybe? No? Am I? I thought this was this area, or am I completely off? Oh, I think it's actually more behind, isn't it? Yeah, alright. Up here? anyone or any signs of people hiding. Oh. Hey, while we're here, you never know, it might have arrows or something. Like I'm not expecting Ooh, a torch. I'm not expecting much, but you know, perhaps something to heal myself with. Occasionally, and you're still you're. St I heard. Is that one of us? Is that one of ours? Pavlina! Don't be afraid, it's me, Manos. Okay, then this is one of ours. No, no, don't. Are you mad shouting like that? Yes! Well, I have to find Pavlena. She got lost when we were running in the night. It's still not safe here. Shouting like that is asking for trouble. But I have to find her. I can't leave without her. Will you help me? Yes! Uh, okay, well, uh, it's pointless. Run. No, uh, okay. Where did you see her last? In the woods here. We were hiding from those demons. I didn't think they'd come here, but when it was getting dark, they found us. They came upon us from behind. I think we surprised them as much as they did us. We started to run, and it was horrible. One arrow missed me by a hair. I thought I was done for. I ran and ran, and then I found myself alone. I lost those bastards, but Pavlena too. I have to find her. Okay, and? What was Pavlina wearing? The same as always. A blue dress, and she had a scarf on her head. Blue dress, scarf, her head is pointless shouting. Just, okay, just... You should keep your voice down. There could still be cutthroats within earshot. But... But I've got to find Pavlina. I've got to help her. All right, no. Can I? Can I? Can I? He's not going to listen to me anyway. I'm a woman, remember? Pavlina! Could you? Find... Let's see what you can sniff out here. Seek. Pavlina! Oh, God, he's making too much noise. Oh, gee. He's going to get us killed. Do it. Wait. Pavlina! Where are they? Follow the dog. Follow the dog. Where was the dog? Wait, I'm following you. I'm following you. I'm following you. Where are you. I'm following you. Can you sniff her out? Just gonna. What is that? Is that oh, actually, that's possibly, possibly good. Possibly, yes. Uh, 
we we might need honey. But right now, and can you find Pavlena? No. All right, let's have a look at this. Help Marosh find Pavlena. All right, we we we've got to get into the woods. I think. So he's sort of shouting in the right area, but we need to go further in. Oh, God. Stop making so much. Oh. This must be that Pavlina that Marosh was looking for. Dead. I should go and tell him. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh. I know this is probably the wrong moment, but I'm thinking, do I have food for for you? Oh, okay, I've got bacon. I got bacon. Um, is bacon enough? Bacon's probably enough for you, right? We we, we can hunt another day. Right, where is Mr. Shouty? Oh, all right. You know what? Let's bear in mind that we're about to tell him something unpleasant. Pavlina! <sighs> Don't be afraid. About Pavlina. We know what yet, yeah, no. Uh... I found her. You did? Where? Why isn't she with you? She fled. No. Uh, no. I'm sorry, but... She's dead. They must have caught up with her when they were chasing you. Oh, no, no, no. My Pavlina, I should never have left her like that. I thought, I thought she was right behind me. Jesus, what am I going to do? You should flee and save yourself at least. I, I don't know what to do now. Where can I go? Go to Tomberg and tell them everything. Sir Divish will send help and... And then we'll come back and bury our loved ones. I promise. All right. What about you? I'll keep looking around for other survivors. If I had half your courage, Pavlena might still be alive. Oh, God. Yeah, probably Take not. This. Maybe you'll come across someone who needs it. God be with you. Bandages. Oh, I will almost certainly come across people who'll need it, unfortunately. Yeah, it's not courage, mate. It's mostly the dog. Um... Right. Yeah, let's just head down towards Scallets and the woodcutters. Getting a bit too close to the walls. If there's anyone on them, they might be able to see us running around down here. Let's just hope they don't care too much. It's over there, isn't it? Isn't it? I think this is it. I mean, it's raining. People don't like to stand around. Poppy. I don't think that's going to be useful for anything, but... Hey. If it is, I've got it, right? St. John's Wort. I've not got any of that, so... Okay. So... Oh. I'm carrying too much. Yeah, I think I can probably drop, I don't know, the... Oof. Some really, really stupid idea. I'm, I'm suddenly thinking, hey, I could sell it. Why? No idea. No, let's, let's just dump. Oh no, let's dump some heavy stuff, yeah. <laughs> Seems silly now, doesn't it? Looking for treasure. <laughs> Stupidly enough, I was actually right over there. Yeah. 
not sure there's anything there that would really make it worth spending any time. Come here. Come here, dog. Dog, come here. I need to talk to you. I want you to be aggressive. No one's a match for but me. But only, anyway. only if they're aggressive back. Okay, don't be, don't be attacking people who are not. You know, well, that could be a mistake. Heal. That does not look. That does not look like a soldier. And it. Okay. I'm just going. Let's see what you can sniff out here. You see? just keep searching. Keep searching. I, I, I don't know if you just get aggressive to everyone if I tell you that. He doesn't look like a robber, does he? No, he, he I think he's oh god. Alright. Julian? Is it you? Don't be afraid. It's me, Teresa. Are you all right? Everywhere. They're everywhere. Where is it? Where is it? Okay. You're one of the woodcutters, aren't you? Yes. Yes. Cutter. Where is it? Quick! They're everywhere! Julian, you're not making any sense. Right. Where's what? I don't understand you. Cutter! Woodcutter! They're everywhere! I need it! Oh my god! God. His axe, maybe? Does he need his axe? Maybe he needs his axe. What happened here? Did anyone else survive? They came. From everywhere. Everywhere. Where is it? How did you survive? You were left here amongst... Amongst all these bodies? Everywhere. Oi, oi, oi. Pull yourself together. No, no. I have to try something else on you. Okay, you, 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 you've got to go. You've got to get out of here, Julian. Pull yourself together. No. They're everywhere. Cutter. They'll find you if you don't run. Uh. Listen, if you stay here, they might come back and kill you. You wouldn't want that, would you? No. Cutter. Where is it? What are you, this um... is going nowhere. I didn't think you would pull yourself. Have I got to shout at him? No, I, I, I don't. That does not look like this a good idea. Hopeless. How am I going to get through to you? Cut her. Cut her. No. No, no. Right, right, Where right. Is Where is it? Julian's axe. You could have just looked around, Julian. You could have just. Julian, pull yourself together. Uh. Here's your axe. Here's your axe. That's what you were looking for, right? Now you'll be safe. Cutter. Yes. My cutter. Good, Julian. And now, get to Tomberg. The others are already on the way there. Run like the devil and don't look back. Tomberg. Yes. Great. And, and if you don't mind a suggestion... Ooh. Don't... Run at the gate of Talberg with that axe out, screaming cutter, cutter, cutter like that. There is a distinct chance they may actually just shoot you. What? 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 No, no, you know, we... No, I already found him. I mean, be good boy. Just, just, no, obviously. Just, just... Yes, very good. Good That's boy. That's a good boy. Now... One more place to find That's my uh, boy. check, and then food. No, no, no. We do that. Do that later. And then we got to go and check in there. So, right, we're here. We need to go to the junction where there's a lot going on, and then just head up the river. Hmm. Is that right? There's the bridge. So we need to go up there. Why are there posts with vases on? Have they always been there and I just wasn't paying attention?
Okay. It doesn't sound like the soldiers. It doesn't sound like the soldiers. That does not sound like the soldiers. Damn this fucking drawer. Only I have lost that damn key. Okay. All right. He's armed. All right. Fuck it. I won't budge. Okay. Master Potter, what in the name of God are you doing here? I'm trying to get into my goddamn house. What for? You ought to flee like everyone else. I've got coin hidden there. I'm not going to just walk off and leave it. Listen, maybe you could help me. I've heard you mill people know how to... how to deal with these kind of things. <sighs> are you implying that I'm a thief? What are you implying? Yes. That I'm a thief? Calm now. Don't play the innocent. We all know your father is no saint. You must have learned some secrets of the trade from him. No? I may. My father is dead. Huh? Yes. Oh, Jesus. Sorry, lass. Uh, I didn't know. I'm sorry. Why can't you unlock the door? Don't you have the key? Of course I do. That is, I did. But I lost it. I was bringing firewood from the woods. Just as I got to the footbridge, I saw that huge army. I dropped everything and ran home as fast as I could. I must have dropped that blasted key on the way. All right, so I can find the key. I can find the key. How did you survive? How did yeah. you manage to survive? I hid out on top of the A stack until morning. Those Edens were sniffing around, but something disturbed them and they ran to the village. Did you check? Did you? Ch Where did you lose the key? Where do you think you might have dropped the key? I'm not sure. It must have been somewhere along the path from the woods. After I passed the footbridge, I was carrying firewood when the raid started. I dropped everything and ran. The key must have fallen on the um, way. So we can find the key. You really should just run. It's still not safe here. Coin is no use to a dead man. You ought to flee to Tomberg while you can. And leave my life savings to pillagers and footpads? Not a chance. I wasn't even thinking it, I promise. Mostly. Okay, I will help you. All right. I'll try and get that coin for you, but I can't promise anything. All right. Where is it hidden? This damn door is as solid as a rock. All right. Once you get inside, go to the pantry on the left. There's a sack of apples in there, and the purse is hidden right at the bottom of it. Sack of apples. Get it, and bring it to me. Meanwhile, I'll keep watch here. All right, so i got to get in there. Can I... Can, can, don't suppose you... Oh... I don't suppose this. I won't budge. I suppose I have to find the key. Oh no 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 no. Oh. Or it's a very easy lock, and as much as I don't want to prove him right about Miller's, I also don't want to go running around looking for a key if I can possibly help it. Right. Uh. over there. Anything else? Right. Oh. My. There really is a purse full of grosh in here. And a pretty heavy one, too. Okay, well... Yeah, yeah, yeah. What else was in there? Nothing. All right. Let's just check around. I know it's his house, but... Take the money to Stanislav. Will do. Will do. Going to do that. Yes, I am. I'm just... Am I hearing... I'm hearing voices. I'm hearing voices. All right, look. He's probably forgotten or lost the key for this as well. Let's see what's in here for him. Definitely worth a look. Okay, you know what? I can give him that as well. I don't... Okay. I warned you. Now you're for it. Sick. Get him. Oh God! No, 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 no. Okay, do, 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 dog, dog, dog. Yes. What's hitting me? Is something hitting me? Is something hitting me? 
Curse. Go and get him, get him. Sick him. Yeah, sick him. Nicely done. Kill him. Christ. Kill him. He's a looter and he was going to kill us. I'm missing. Somebody kill him. Or, or not. Or not. Or okay, okay. Can we please kill him? He's dying a little slowly. My God almighty. With all the horror that's going on, he wouldn't have thought twice about killing us on account of money. People can be swine. They see a corpse and come swooping down like carrion crows. You shouldn't feel bad about it. He got what he deserved. Yeah. Take the money. Take it and go to Tomberg. Warn them there and tell them to send help. I'll have a look around the village for survivors. I'll do that. Take care of yourself, Teresa. Yeah, I'm gonna do my best. All right, apples going off. Groschen taking it. Lo oh yes, yeah. I'm guessing I can't wear a noble's male collar, but just well, there's no way in. There... I mean, I can't even wear a black hood. I can't even wear a hood. Oh, that's not what I wanted to. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I mean, like, why can't I wear a bloody black hood, at least to make me a little harder to see. Okay, so, now we just wander down the road and uh, carefully peek into the walls. Yeah. Alright. I've discovered a nest. Oh. My aim is kind of sucky, but oh, a, a, a cobweb! Ah, totally useful. Could you? Did you see the? Did you see the arrow? The arrow. Oh. You know what? I probably shouldn't worry too much about it. Let's face it. I, I've had zero luck hitting things with arrows. Anyway, um, how many have I got? Five better piercing arrows and one normal piercing arrow. Yeah. Uh, where is the main gate? Okay. I think this is it. I think that's the side gate there. I think that leads to there. Can we see anything? So, okay. Come on, 
I've had just about enough of you. Hey, go fuckers! That's, uh... I don't know what to say. You don't have to say anything. You've been through it yourself. I know you understand. <sighs> um, I'd like to ask about There's so something yeah. else I'd like to ask. Is there? That's it. Yeah. Remember how we were sore fighting together? The next morning, Ma scolded me on account of that scratch on my hand. Oh, dear. <laughs> Sorry about that. Ah, it's all water under the bridge now. I never told her it was you who did it. I just wish you could have covered my back, too. She was angry that I was at sword training instead of working in the forge. And she said you told her. Okay. Yeah, my bad. Uh, or her bad. Yeah, okay, this is going to be a little confusing. Your pa and Stebor were really stealing from the royal mines. Jesus. I don't think even Fritz and Matthew would take that kind of chance. And there's not much that pair won't do for an easy groschen. Oh, no, yeah. they would have done it. In a way, I can understand that Pod did it for us, but it was really irresponsible. You won't tell anyone, will you? I won't, I promise. Of course not! So what happened to the silver? Pa handed it over, as always, to that slimy fellow, and he took it away. What happened to it then, I don't know. And, uh, yeah, this is, this is just a little bit uncomfortable. Comfortable, but um, your pa really wanted to marry you off to Master Tobias. Yes, can you believe it? And have you spoken to Master Fayfar since, since the raid? I haven't. Either he's lost interest, or he's forgotten about me. Not that I'm complaining. Uncle Peshek would be happy to marry me off too, especially if there was something in it for him. I'm glad that's in the past. I, I don't blame you. Yeah, that's an interesting question, though, isn't it? With my heritage and everything now being... Right. So Johanka and Matthias finally got together. Well, if it hadn't been for everything that happened afterwards, who knows? They could be headed for the altar. But that little intrigue with the dice... I never thought you'd stoop to stealing. It was all in a good cause. Johanka would never have plucked up the courage to talk to him otherwise. And in the end, her harebrained scheme actually worked. Who knows? Maybe the two of them will get together again. Yeah, I might go and ask her about that. Bianca told me something about your little expedition to the woods. 
did you really meet a war? Uh, yeah, no. She was flaunting that ring all day. I was worried for a while that she had some other suitor who gave it to her. No, no. Unless you can count a magpie. Oh, yeah. Uh, and, and, and... Bianca told me something about your little expedition I want, to the I want to know if you're going to lie and say it was a wolf. You really ran into a wolf? I thought Bianca must have been imagining things. Not exactly. It was actually a wild dog, but... Paul used to say those are even worse than wolves. It's a good thing you were there with Bianca. Yeah. Going back to help the survivors. That was very brave of you. When I went back to Scallets, I met no one but footpads and cutthroats. If you hadn't come along, I doubt I'd be here to tell the tale. You know what our parish priest always used to say? Without Christian charity, we'd all soon be dead. I couldn't just leave you all to your fate, could I? Any good Christian would have done the same. Well, I'm not so sure. Not everyone has your courage. Thing is, is I'd sort of assumed that, um, that she had brought the people from Talmberg and told them where to find me, but she just saw them riding around and knew they were coming and just stepped out at the right moment to distract the guy from the killing blow. I mean, she saved me just by that. That, that momentary distraction was required. But she was a little bit lucky herself, wasn't she? I mean, she just obviously was just... She just had enough at that point, but, I mean... And, of course, the dog wasn't Tinker. I... I... Yeah. It, I sort of... I kind of... I knew Tinker was her dog, and I knew... The dog I met here wasn't her dog, because she said so, but... I hadn't really thought it far enough through to realise what was going to happen. But anyway, yeah. Did you go back to Scallets again to bury your pa and your brothers? Yes, along with some more of our neighbours. We had an escort from the Ratai garrison, with Sir Hanish's kind permission. Where are they buried? Sammy's buried near the mines. He didn't like the mines. But his grave is on the hill, where I used to meet him for lunch. He loved it there. I know it's not consecrated ground, but what could I do? God will understand. I buried Ma and Pa under the linden tree by our house. It's what they would have wanted. Yes. Father and Stebo are buried in the churchyard in Rovna. Once things settle, we'll be able to go back and pay our respects and get the priest to bless their graves. Yeah. Yeah. I have no more questions. Thank you for telling me about everything, Teresa. I know it isn't easy to talk about. It helped to talk to someone who knows what it's like. Thank you. I'm glad you came out of it in one piece. Yeah, so am I. And I'm glad you did, too. By the way, Henry, I have something for you. The soldiers gave it to me when we brought you from Scalates. I meant to give it to you earlier, but, you know, it belonged to one of the Scalates' garrison. They wanted me to have it for being brave, but... I hope I'll never have use for such a thing. Oh? How come? What is it? It's a shield with the Scalit's crest. I'd like you to have it, to protect you, and as a keepsake from home. Sure. Thanks, Teresa. Thanks for everything. Yeah. Yeah, you, you do look a little different, actually. I should have put... Yeah. All right. That was a little sad. But you know what? I think it's good to get these sort of things out in the open. And hey. But... Okay, well, that's one way to ruin the moment.